540 right now. Welcome back to Fox Room and Local News. Do you have a sweet tooth? <laughs> if the answer is yes, there's a new place in town that you need to check out. Speaking of sweet, oh, Laura McDonald <laughs> live and local right now, checking out Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar, showing us it's nothing short of delicious. Good morning, Lord. <laughs> Good morning. Yes, sweet, savory, sinful. The three S's. You can find them right here at Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. And that's where we are live and local all morning long. So here with Brittany and Rachel, I love sweets. So I'm very excited about this morning. And we're going to start off with a milkshake because why not? Right. Right? Okay, so what is this milkshake? So we are doing our cake it up shake. Mm -hmm. So it's three scoops of our homemade gelato. Okay. So here I've got red velvet. And then we have a red velvet bundt cake. Okay. So we're going to... Stick the bun cake, cake it in up. there. I love it. And Brittany, you guys just opened last Friday, so this place is brand new. Brand new. Yep. And when did you open a dessert bar? Well, um, it's a sister store to Small Cakes. There's one in Colorado Springs, and I kind of just love the concept. And living in Monument, we don't have a lot of options, so this came about and. I thought it was a good idea and right. kind of went for it. Why not? Right. You guys make everything from scratch every single day. Every day. So freshness, you can count on it right here. All right. So we're going to blend it up. So the skillets are probably the most, the most popular. Um, we have a lemon berry mascarpone cake that's really popular, red velvet cheesecake, carrot cake. Had a lot of things that pretty much everything sells really well. All right. So it's a go. All right. So then whenever we do our milkshakes, what we do is we get some chocolate sauce. Mm -hmm. And then we normally coat the rim with sprinkles or oh. we can do other options too we can do thought cookies you were going to hand me a plate full of fudge there <laughs> <laughs> okay so decorating the cup there you go we decorate the cup it just kind of gives it a nice little touch sometimes our milkshakes get really messy but mm -hmm. the messier the better that's right so we're just gonna pour this look in. at that now is this one of your favorites it is I think you can't go really wrong with red velvet. No, definitely not. Rich, delicious, and this morning, you know what? We're going to say it's nutritious. Because yes. it is all made from scratch, and I don't really care if it's bad for you. Because we're here, like I said, dessert today, all day long. What are we making next? So next we're going to do a latte. Okay. Specialty latte. I like the sound of that. A latte. Can I have a sip? Of course now, you did can. did you mean to do that? No, I did not. Well, I, I like, like it. A little it's extra. extra. <laughs> mm. Yes. It is a good day to be alive, my friends. In her happy Woo! place. Mm, so jealous right now. Yeah. Yeah, I tell you what. My family, mm -hmm. we go there and we get the skillet, the, the donut hole skillet. It's oh. a skillet full of glazed donut holes, just stacked up, all hot, <laughs> glazed. And they, Those they, are coming up. Oh, oh by the way, with a giant Cycle Bar is right next door. Yeah. I think I might have to go in between each live shot. You can work out. Pedal it out a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Lord, thanks. It's good stuff, I tell you what, all morning long. I'm, I'm going to be we're, stopping there. We're hungry already this morning. I know, it's not good. Yeah, all right, 540. Ah, love is in the air. I've got something borrowed. I've got something blue, and coming up, we're making a latte that says, I love you, live and local from Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. That's coming up after the break. 622, welcome back to Fox Marine Local News right now. Do you have a sweet tooth? If the answer is yes, there's a new place in town that you have to check out. Sugar and spice and all things nice. Laura McDonald is in her happy place this morning, live and local right now, checking out Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. Showing us it's nothing short of delicious. Lauren, we're all jealous. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. You should be. And I got to tell you, Craig and Abby. Yeah. Wedding bells are ringing and my taste buds <laughs> are singing. <laughs> That's because this is so good. Live and local 
a decadent dessert and coffee bar. Just did you see that just go flying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't top of your mouth full. Rule number one. Okay, so Brittany and Rachel, we're making a latte. Tell us what this is so I can swallow my food. So we are doing a wedding cake latte. And what it is, is it's two shots of espresso. We have several different pumps that we're doing. Um, we do some vanilla, we do a cupcake, and we do an almond. So we have our espresso. Rachel's gonna start doing the espresso here. Okay. So we'll do our- 12 different lattes you guys have, right? We have 12 different lattes, but we also have a lot of other lattes that we can do. Mm -hmm. And we specialize in whatever people want. If we've got the syrup, we can make whatever you want. We also offer different kinds of milk, so mm -hmm. and that's not upcharged. Right. So giving every people what they want. I options. like it. Yes. So um, after she does the espresso, mm -hmm. she's gonna steam the milk, and we're just gonna do a regular latte, um, not a specialty latte, just with the whole milk. Okay. Very nice. And then you guys want me to do the syrup, right? Yep. You yep. can do the syrup. And what makes the wedding cake latte a wedding cake latte? Just the flavors in it. Okay. So every latte is unique, so for this one especially, it tastes like a traditional wedding cake. Okay. So you're gonna do some vanilla. Okay. And, and then, then we have cupcake. All right. I'm down for the cupcake. <laughs> and then we have the almonds. Wow, you guys really, uh, i to be careful when you're getting in here, huh? <laughs> so many yeah. uh, different flavors to choose from. All right, I think I got it. Just gotta wait a few more seconds. So this, this is the uh, espresso, right? Mm -hmm. This is the espresso, yes. Okay. And we do have regular coffee too. Mm -hmm. And we get that brewed and it actually comes from Peru, Honduras, and Nicaragua. Oh, wow. So, yeah. and it's got a bold flavor. The espresso is not bitter. Let's pour this in real quick. Okie dokie. Very nice. It's mixing quite well. <laughs> so a latte is a latte because of the amount of milk in it, right? Mm -hmm. The amount of milk, yes. Right. Cappuccinos, macchiatos, there's all different kinds of coffee drinks that we can do here. Very nice. It's d done now? It is done. Done and delicious. We are diving into decadence all morning long. I know you two wish you were here, but don't worry, I'm gonna need, I'm going to eat enough calories for all four of us, including Matt. That's a whole lot of good information there this morning. Hey! -o. I am just feeling so loving this morning after, after sipping on this wedding cake. Latte! I love it a latte! I could use one of those. Gotta sign a prenup to drink it though when you're there. Yeah. All right, that's yeah. good stuff. Thanks, Lord. All right, five, uh, six, twenty. Delicious desserts all day long. And you know what, coming up after the break, I might not be able to see it, but I can definitely taste it. More coffee and cake, from what I understand, is coming up next. 641, welcome back to Fox 20 Local News. Right now, from Mason Jar Milkshakes to Molten Lava Cake, today is extra sweet because Lauren is live and local serving up sweet treats at Colorado Springs' newest business dedicated to dessert. Right now, she joins us from Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar where there's always room for dessert. And uh, Lauren, you're blindfolded now. The taste test uh, will, will, will let us know how well you know these sweets. <laughs> this is the happy dance yeah. right here. <laughs> Guess what? Decadent dessert and coffee bar. It's where the confection keeps on coming and the calories do not count. So count me in because we are live and local here all morning long. Now I'm going to do a little taste test of cake. We've got Brittany and Rachel. And Rachel, I believe, is going to make a uh, frappuccino, correct? Yes. Okay, so. You go ahead and explain the frappuccino that she's gonna make, Brittany. Okay, so Rachel's gonna make a mocha frapp, and it's basically a frozen coffee drink. We do a shot of espresso. We have our frapp mix. So she's gonna blend that all together. We put whipped cream on top, and it goes down really nice and smooth. Okay. And so then, yep. Now we're gonna do the taste testing while she's doing that, right? Yes. So you've got three different kinds of cake. I'm supposed to guess the flav flavor of each one, right? Yes. Okay, so you might have to guide me a little bit because I can't okay. exactly see. Um, oh yeah, I feel it. Carrot cake. Yep. Oh, I got it right! That one is correct. 
Okay. And then we're gonna go this way. All right. Oh, yeah, that's right in the middle. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> okay. Let's scoop you up this way. Oh, oh no, that's not. Here, we'll use this fork. Okay. Just feed me, Brittany. Okay. Just feed me. <laughs> oh wow, that was a bigger bite than I thought. Mmm. Something chocolate. Yes, that's our decadent double chocolate cake. It's delicious. And then we're gonna, I'm just gonna help you out this time. Okay, that's probably a good idea. Try not to give you a big bite, but it kinda is, okay. Mmm. Mmm, mmm. Not sure, but it's good. So this is our red velvet mm -hmm. cheesecake. So all the cakes are made here fresh every single day. So those are just a few of the options. We also have a ton of other options. Normally there's something here for everybody. If you right. have a family that comes in. Can we keep going? Can we you keep, can keep going? You can have whatever you want. That's the one thing you said earlier though. Oh, uh, a family of four can come in here and there is something for everyone. You there guys is. don't just do sweet things. You have breakfast sandwiches, right? We have breakfast sandwiches. We have smoothies. Mm -hmm. We have gelato. Ten different flavors. We make that in house as well. Mm -hmm. Everything made fresh. Everything is made fresh. Which I love. One of three stores in the nation. Yes. We're the so, third one right now. A very great spot and for good reason. Oh my goodness. Got a goodness. little messy. Keeps on getting better. This is the Frappuccino, right? Yes, ma'am. Poof. Oh, yep, that's the mocha frap. I'd frap that. <laughs> that is good. That is real good, guys. I'll tell you what, we're one big frappy <laughs> family this morning. Lively Mocha here from Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. You, you're going to get wine pretty soon. We are. We're working on our wine and beer license, so we will have that. Keeps getting better. <laughs> it keeps getting better. Who's gonna eat right? all that food? Who's I was gonna, gonna eat say, all the food? You better bring that back. Me? <laughs> I'm not sharing. She's <laughs> not sharing. I'm, my new nickname's gonna be Chubby. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, Chubby, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna stick now, right? Yeah. All right, uh, 6.45 right now, let's go ahead. Looky, looky. We're baking cookies. Live and local from Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. We will see you guys when we're back for free. Answer is yes, there's a new place in town that you need to check out. And speaking of sweets, <laughs> yes, Laura McDonald is live and local right now. Check it out. Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar showing us it's nothing short of delicious. Lauren, we good morning. We are hanging out here at Decadent Dessert and Wine Bar. I am with Maria channeling my inner Maria. We've got the skillets and they are hot. I'll tell you what. Watch your fingers. Craig and Abby, right. a lot of gooing and going. But this is not for the babies. This is what you call a cookie skillet. Right, Maria? That's right. We and you and brownie skillet. You are the lead baker here. You're the baking manager. So these are one of your most popular items, right? Yes. Okay. Well, I cannot wait to decorate. You and I are going to do that, right? We Brittany? are going to do that. Okay. So how do we start? Okay. So we have both of our, probably put this on here so we don't burn our hands. Okay. So we have our gelato that we make here every day. So we're going to do any, you can get any kind of gelato that you want on these, but it comes with the vanilla bean. Okay. So, so I could like make it my own if I want. Yes. Do you so want to make it your it. own? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You do vanilla okay. and I'll just get crazy. You get crazy. Yeah, that's what I like to do. Oh, a lot to choose from. What's the blue? The blue is called cookie, cookie, cookie. Ooh, I like it. I think I might go with that. Keep the cookie theme. So do I just grab this one right here? You can. All right. Cookie? Did cookie? you want the brownie or did you want the cookie skillet? Uh, I'll, I'll keep the cookie. Well, you just got a little bit of vanilla with yours. All right. That's all right. I'll take it. So you said, again, one of the most popular items on your menu. And what makes you guys so unique is you, we just saw Maria do it. You make everything from scratch every yep. morning. Yep. Okay, now what? So you're gonna decorate it. So typically it would have chocolate sauce drizzled mm -hmm. and the caramel sauce and then a little bit of powdered sugar. Okay. So go ahead, you can dig in. <laughs> okay, very nice. And there's no rules? There is no rules. There's a way that it typically comes, but people can request things. However they want. However they like them here. All right. We can customize. Got to put the, got to well, put see, the strength in just, there. This should be your second job. 
I believe you're right. And you're hiring, aren't you? I, yes, I am. Looking for people? I, uh, I might, might be out. All right, so check out my skills. They're very good. And I do like sweet things, so cannot beat that. Now you guys give a 20% discount to all military, right? Military and first responders. Very yes. nice. And why do you choose to do that? Give back to the reasons. Yeah, give back to the community and they just do so much for everybody, so you know, they deserve it. All right. I think I've got an explosion of <laughs> chocolate here. Do you want your powdered sugar? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You do. No. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's how you do it in here. Whatever slices your pie, right? That's right. All right, let me grab a fork. I want to dig in. Is this, you just eat it right out of the skillet? Yep. Oh, that skillet is hot. Yeah, it might be warm. Mm. I love the sound. It smells like I'm sinning right now. <laughs> uh, making a lot there of are, There's no calories in these. No calories? No calories. Yeah, Sounds no good. Calories. Yeah, all right, guys, make sure you come free. out and check out Decadent Desserts and Coffee Bar. They are located at 13375 Voyager Parkway. You are sure going to have a sweet time out here. We are live and local for the rest of the morning. For now, toss it on back to you because I got to eat. It's good. It's <laughs> good Ooh. stuff. Good. Oh. Oh, I can't mm. wait to go and check it out. But, uh, big chunk of chocolate. Lauren's not behind the counter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh Twinkie, Twinkie, little star. Hey, these aren't Twinkies. What? Coming up after the break, we're going to tell you what they are. We are live and local at Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. That's coming up after the break. 740. Welcome back to Fox Real Local News right now. From Mason Jar Milkshakes to Molten Lava Cake, today is extra sweet because Lauren McDonald is live and local serving up sweet treats at Colorado Springs' newest business dedicated to dessert. And right now she joins us from Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar where there's always room for dessert. Lauren, good morning. That's right. Good morning, Craig and Abby. And listen, I got to ask you both a question. What do you call a thief who steals your dessert? What? A crookie! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a crookie. All right, but we're not crookies here because we're making our own crookies. Cookies. We're making all kinds of treats. And right now, we're making a big boy, which is great for soon to be a big girl right here. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is not a Twinkie, right? It looks like a Twinkie, right. though. So Maria, the head baker here at Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar. So how do we, how do, we do this? How do we get started? Well, first we bake off three different flavors, vanilla, chocolate, red velvet, and these are all made from scratch. These aren't like shipped to you frozen, right? Right. We bake them right here, fresh every day. Okay. So we just take whichever? We take one of each? Yep. Grab it, flip it over, and then we're going to fill them with this buttercream. Do I do this? So that's for the red velvet, so okay, you can get well, started on the red velvet. With that one. Yeah. So you just poke get the tip right into the side, and then... Squeeze as you pull the tip, and then that fills it. Just do Ooh. one on each side to make sure that it is filled with buttercream goodness. It's very important. Yeah, and can't it's have uh, he can't have it empty in the middle. That's right. You got to have cream in every bite. All right, kind of like a cannoli. This is how you fill a cannoli. Yeah, really similar to filling cannolis or eclairs. All right, so Maria, you guys just opened uh, last Friday, actually. So brand new. What makes this place so unique and special? Wow. Well, I can't think of a single place in town that is a dessert bar, you know, a dessert and coffee destination mm -hmm. where you can get fresh, warm desserts or hot right out of the oven. And uh, we try to offer, we're going to start offering different things as we become more comfortable here. Right. And, you know, eventually we'll have new specials to try. So. Your favorite thing on the menu? It's the chocolate chip cookie skillet. Oh, I just had a bite. Either I that totally or get where you're coming from. The turtle cheesecake is amazing too. So, head baker here, how did you get into baking? Well, uh, I originally started cooking a long time ago um, as a kid, and then um, I went to culinary school and decided to pick up the baking degree as well, mm -hmm. and that's when I discovered that I'm really good at baking, and I never knew it. Well, <laughs> there you go. Yeah. And you're at the right place, right? Because you make everything here fresh, daily, decadent, desserts, and wine bar. I think I messed up because I use this filling for everything. Oh, that's okay. Cream cheese tastes good with all these flavors. There you go. All right. I'm making it my own, and, and you can do that here. Craig and Abby got one more question for you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> why was the Twinkie grumpy? <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Do you know, Craig? No, I don't. No, I don't. Because <laughs> he had a piping bag up his behind. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's a real joke. That's I mean. a joke. <laughs> Lauren, please bring those back. Please bring Maddie's those back. Please bring them back. Begging. Yes. I'm getting full. <laughs> and by the way, the big boy. Big girl. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, baby. All right. Mm, you were jealous. Yeah, that wasn't a joke. Yeah, I, I think you made that one up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 743 right now. Well, in color. Wine. How about chocolate? You want to slice of this action? Well, we're going to give you a taste live and local from Decadent Food and Wine Bar. That's coming up next. Now, do you have a sweet tooth? If the answer is yes, there's a new place in town that you need to check out. It's on my list for sure now. Yes, Lauren, for sure, in her happy place right now. She's live and local, checking out Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar and showing us now it's nothing short of delicious. Lauren, good morning. Never gonna give you up. <laughs> Never gonna let you down. Never gonna run around or desert you. <laughs> But we are yeah, going to give you some dessert. We're not going to desert you, but we are going to give you some dessert because that is what they're all about here at Decadent. Uh, it is a coffee bar and it is also a dessert bar. And we've been doing dessert all morning with Maria, oh, yeah. the head baker here. You are in charge of all that goes down back here in the kitchen, right? That's right. <laughs> baking my dreams come true. I love it. Okay, so we're, we're baking one of your, it's already been baked, but we're, Finishing off one of one of the signature items here, right? Yes, this is the decadent chocolate cake. Mm -hmm. it so it's like the trademark cake here. Yes. All right. So, so we make sure. So how do you this do this? Right. All right. So I fill the inside with a whipped chocolate icing, which is homemade, right? Yes. We so what's in that icing? Ourselves. How do you make a whipped so icing? So it's whipped cream, but then it has chocolate sauce and some cocoa powder in it to give it an extra chocolatey punch. And then, just fill this in. Wow, you just make it look so easy. <laughs> yep, now, are you baking perfect. all day? Yes, we keep that oven Going. constantly filled to, uh, to keep our stuff fresh and to keep the customers happy, keep right. us in stock. And I'm just gonna smooth this out. Okay, now here in Colorado, the altitude baking is a lot different. Do you guys have to adjust the recipes? Yes, we do. Um, for high altitude baking, um, you have to add a little bit more flour and a little less fat mm -hmm. and a little bit less leavener. Okay, leavener. That's, That's what makes it rise. I see. Very mm -hmm. good. I'm learning yeah. something new every day. Because our altitude just makes things go. Poof. The altitude mm -hmm. naturally makes things rise. So okay. um, we reduce the amount of leavener to. Uh, I'll be your support yeah. system here. <laughs> Don't want to let the cake fall. All right. And then there's our next wow, layer. Wow, that's beautiful. Little tip: if you freeze your layers before stacking and cutting, it makes it way easier. That's what we call a hot tip. Yes. At Fox 21 News. All right, so All this right. is the actual icing, right? Yes, yeah, so this is the chocolate buttercream for the outside. And I see it's got a different whatever yeah. this is. So if we want to be fancy, you could use that side. But since it's just going to get smoothed mm -hmm. anyway, I'm just going to leave easy. it like that. And then wow. start. I have kind of overloaded my bag here, so I'm going to pinch down on it to, yeah, there we go. Now I'm just going to spin while I apply. Wow, very nice. Yeah, and then how you frost You just kind of keep on decorating. People are going to have to come on down and get a taste for themselves if they want to try it, right? That's right. Guys, make sure you come on out here to Voyager Parkway and uh, get a taste of this delicious everything. Everything. Really, everything I've had has been so good. I am on a sugar high right now. Guys, <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm trying not to sprinkle my pants, okay? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I am working on though. thin icing comes, as well. I am aware of that. <laughs> comes the sugar crash. You are so good right. with We'll see that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, it's coming. It's coming. <laughs> All right, Lauren, thanks. All right, day 25. Mason jar milkshakes to molten lava cake. Today is extra sweet because Lauren is live and local serving up sweet treats at Colorado Springs' newest business dedicated to dessert. Yes, and right now she joins us from Decadent Dessert and Coffee Bar where there is always room for dessert. Lauren, good morning. That's right, Craig and Abby, check it out. 
These are my new friends. I like to call them the Kardashians, right? We have so many Kardashians here, and you can come meet them and hang out with them. Eat them yourself at Decadent Dessert and Wine Bar. That's where we have been live and local all morning with Brittany and Maria. Uh, Maria, you've been showing me how to bake. Brittany, you've been telling us all about this brand new dessert bar that you own here in Colorado Springs. Yep. So you guys do coffee and you dessert. You do desserts. Uh, tell me about all the different varieties of things that you do here. So we have breakfast sandwiches, we have smoothies, mm -hmm. we've got homemade gelato, we've got um, milkshakes. Right. We have bundt cake milkshakes, all kinds of good Very stuff. Very nice. All right, so uh, as we said, Maria, you, you are the lead baker here. You are in charge back there in the kitchen. So we're going to decorate a carrot cake right now. Yes. What's up, Doc? Let's do this, okay? So you're going to give me kind of like the easier version, right? Yes. Okay, so what's the first step? All right, so the first step, well, I've already done it, is to mark the cake. It marked out our 12 slices. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Never so that, thought about um, doing that. So all of our rosettes will be on top of a, of a slice. A rosette. That's like, so oh, okay. This yes. is a rosette. It's a basic piping technique. We just make a little, cute little rosette. You want to try making one? Oh, let's try it. All, all right, so you're right-handed. Rosette is out. What? All right. Are you right-handed? I am. Okay. I am. So hold with your right hand, okay. and then use your left hand to guide the tip. Okay. So you hold the bag in your hand like that. Yep. And then with your left hand, oh, guide the tip. I yes. see. Okay. Very nice. And Brittany. And then release pressure. Yes. Look at those rosettes. <laughs> oh, look at those rosettes. You're hiring, <laughs> right? Can I get? Can I join the team? Absolutely. All right. So Hopefully. you really do have something for everyone. We just talked about uh, all of the different desserts you have. You yes. even have gluten-free options, right? We do have. We have a uh, chocolate molten lava cake that's gluten-free. We have several different gelatos that are gluten-free. Our creme brulee is gluten-free. And we also have French macaroons that I sell in a set that are gluten-free. Very nice. How do you like that? Uh, all right. That looks awesome. Yes. My job interview right here. Yeah. <laughs> so, all right, so I'll watch you do the next step. This is my favorite part. OK. So we're going to make carrots on each slice. Oh, carrots. I got that covered. Once I put the leaf on it, it's going to look exactly like a carrot. Okay. So you just Very do cool. a little squiggle, and then that creates the the carrot look. Yes, yeah. I love it. So many great tips here. Hot tips for baking. It has been such a fun day. Thank you guys so much for having us out. Uh, Brittany, tell everybody where you're located if they want to come check you out. And when you're open? Uh, we are open Monday through Saturday from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. And we're at 13375 Voyager Parkway, Suite 110. Very nice. All right. Well, we've got a slice of carrot cake already made here. I'm going to try a bite. Mm. Tastes so good. Make a grown man cry. And guess what, guys? I have a new motto. Hanging out here all morning has got me believing. Pies before guys for life here. <laughs> Make sure you come and check out Decadent Food or excuse me, dessert and coffee bar. Woo, woo, it's been a good day. Pies before guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pies before guys for life. For life. <laughs> for life. All right. Yeah. Lauren, Lauren thank start, you all. Start thank boxing you. some You're of welcome. that stuff thank up. You. <laughs> all all right. the boxing. Don't worry. <laughs> 843 right now. Well, more news across.